What is up guys? Welcome back to another episode. Um, today we are going to start tearing apart the front end of the car. Um, I'm going to show you guys how to take off the front bumper, and the side skirts, and the fenders. Uh, headlights, auxiliary lights, stuff like that. Um, so let's just get to it and start tearing stuff apart. So first you want to take the strip off here. If you plan on, take, or if you plan on keeping anything, uh, keep this because this will help a lot. It'll help uh, keep the structure of the bumper and help keep the 10 millimeter bolts from going through the bumper and damaging them. So apparently someone used the wrong bolts here and it stripped out uh, so we'll have to figure a way to fix that later um, let's continue on same for that side too that bolt was also the wrong bolt um, now let's move on to the bottom of the bumper hopefully you guys can see this uh, let's see if I can set up the camera correctly That should be it. You have a bolt hole there and a bolt hole there. Then you got these up top. Got one on this corner of the fender here. Oh, there goes that sign marker. One on this corner here. I know. And then that should be it. As you can see, it comes off like that. I'm gonna re-glue that maybe, possibly. All right, so got the bumper off. Next to do is the uh, auxiliary lights here, which we already took this one off and this one off. So all we have to do is take that off there and that off there, and then these should come out too. Um, so let's do that. So these have plugs here. All you gotta do is just unplug it. Top plug there comes off. Little top plug here comes right off. Got this little plug here. I'm not too worried about saving these because I'm putting the 97 bumper on. But uh, I'll probably end up cleaning them up, possibly selling them to whoever wants them. So next will be the headlights. Headlights, you got that one there, that one there, got this one here. All right. You got those there. Oh, well that one came off too. Oh, I forgot about the side one over here. So you got the side one here. All right. So those come out. Unscrew this here. Bolt comes out. 
and then unplug this. Uh, and then that's that. So you got one, two, three, and then four there. So we'll repeat it with this side over here. Bolts are really rusted, really old. Side marker light. And that headlight's already gone, so I ain't got to worry about plugging that one. Or unplugging that one. So, sitting right here. So, I'll just put that back in. Um, I will probably, most likely, do a restore video on these headlights, reseal the corner lights, and uh, probably sell them. Because I'm not going to need them, I've got the JDM headlights, and plus I also have eBay one pieces too that I'm probably going to restore, and possibly sell those too. Um, so let's move on to the fender. Alright, so with the fender, you got these three bolts up top, here, you got this one bolt here, and then you got the two bolts down here. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. This one here, it's kind of hard to get to sometimes because uh, of the door. And of course, with my garage thingy. Okay. The two bottom fingers, a little side skirt down a little bit. We should be able to get to them. Okay. So once again, one, two, three, four, five, six. Six bolts takes the fender off. Um, go ahead and I'm going to do the other side. So I was mistaken. It's actually another bolt that's down here. It's up underneath the fender. Right here, I guess the person who had it before me never put it back. So that's uh, what? Seven bolts total. And it should come off. Uh, fender liner. Forgot about the fender liner. So the fender liner, you got these bolts on the outside. We got one, two, three that are Phillips heads. If you're on the ground and you don't have your car in the air, stubbies work best. Give you some clearance, unless you're lowered. Sometimes a little washer thing spins along with it. Just hold it and continue spin. They're only plastic. Got some on the inside too. Um, don't think you need to take those. Here. See, you can leave those on just to take off the fender. So what I was talking about, you got here, here, and here, and here. And you got the ones on the inside too. Probably can't see, but you got one there. 
Got one there, one there, and uh, I think that's it. Got one deep on the inside there. Um, but yeah, so that's how you take off the front end. So now we got the fenders off, the bumper off, the headlights and the auxiliary lights off. Uh, I'm going to take the wires for the headlights. I'm gonna bring them back around the shock tower, run them back inside here, and have them come out here and run them along the fender to kind of tuck the wires to give the inside of the engine bay a better look, uh, more cleaner, less cluttered because that's really cluttered. Um, but yeah, so that's my plans for next weekend. Today's Sunday, I gotta go back to work tomorrow. Uh, so next Friday, I'll probably do that and make another video about it. Show you guys exactly how to do it. Um, and then I guess we'll put on the 97 bumper and the JDM headlights uh, and then go from there. But um, that's it for today. But uh, you guys take it easy and I'll see you in the next one.